Are you thinking of adding more storage capacity to an overwhelmed laptop? Or need something to back up sensitive files? Or just want a drive that will let you take your files with you wherever you go? Well, getting one of the best portable SSDs might be the way to go. That is, as long as you're prepared to spend a little more, since they aren't as cheap as portable hard drives, though they continue to drop in price and rise in popularity. Even so, as expensive as they are, the best portable SSDs are worth the investment. That's why, in today's video, we've gathered 5 of the best portable SSDs on the market right now, so you can rest easy knowing your purchase is the best one for you. For more information and updated prices about the products mentioned, check the links in the description box below. Without further ado, let's get started. At number 5, we present to you the ADATA SE730H. This small and compact external hard drive offers very decent speeds, as well as a rugged body that keeps it safe from water, as well as drops and knocks. It's not the fastest drive out there, as it's still reliant on the aging SATA technology rather than the newer and faster NVMe tech. But for the money, you're still getting a brilliant performer. ADATA claims this is the most compact external SSD with dimensions of 72.7 by 44 by 12.2 millimeters and weighing only 37 grams, excluding the cable. It's smaller and lighter than Samsung's T3 and T5 drives, which are also two of the best portable SSDs on the market right now. And while it is pricey compared to some of the other external SSDs we have on the list, remember that it comes with military-certified protection. It passes the stringent MIL-standard 810G516.6 impact resistance test, so it should survive accidental drops and shocks without much damage. What's more, if you shop around, you can also get it for less than its recommended retail price. Moving on, if you want speed above all else and money is almost no factor, then the Samsung X5 Portable SSD is the best portable SSD for you. It comes with a Thunderbolt 3 connection that takes full advantage of the super-fast speeds of the brilliant Samsung 970 EVO NVMe SSD that comes inside. However, that pure dedication to speed comes at some expense. First, there's the financial expense, as this is a pricey external SSD. It's also larger and bulkier than the Samsung T7 or Samsung T5, which are also on this list. That said, the device is fairly heavy at 150 grams, triple the weight of the Samsung T5, and at 116 by 60 by 18 millimeters, it can be best described as portable rather than miniature. However, when it comes to performance, the Samsung X5 Portable SSD is definitely the portable SSD to go for. Also, if you have a Thunderbolt 3 equipped device and plan to move content to other TB3 hardware as well, then the X5 is a godsend. It is expensive and the transfer speeds aren't as spectacular as one might expect, but this drive is still exceptionally fast given the right connector. But then again, Samsung made it clear in marketing message that this is a halo effect product. In other words, not something destined for the mainstream market, with that audience having the T5 and the T3 to purchase. Instead, the X5 will appeal to, and likely convince, those looking for the ultimate in performance, regardless of the price. At number 3, we present to you the Seagate Fast SSD. This is an impressively slim external SSD at only 9mm thick with a footprint of 94 by 79mm. This means that it can easily slip into your pocket and be carried around comfortably. At 82 grams, it's also extremely light as well as compact, although not as compact as the My Passport SSD. When it comes to performance, this drive is ranked amongst the fastest without resorting to any sort of magic tricks. What's more, the drive is XFAT formatted, which makes it compatible out of the box with Windows and Mac. You also get a free download of Seagate's own toolkit suite, which includes backup and folder mirroring capabilities. Overall, the Seagate Fast SSD is affordable, with prices likely to drop, and it's an excellent performer. Relatively small, plus it has a nice design and a three-year warranty. That being said, the Seagate Fast SSD is well worth considering if you're looking for the best portable SSD for a low price. At number 2, we present to you the Samsung T5. This SSD builds on the brilliant design and performance of its predecessor, the Samsung T3 SSD. 
but it brings it up to date with an incredibly fast USB Type-C connection that ekes out every last drop of performance from the solid-state drive inside. For starters, the drive measures 74 by 57 by 10.5 millimeters and weighs only 51 grams, making it small and light enough to be shoved into even a tight front jeans pocket with ease. It's made entirely of metal with a swish brushed finish. Choosing a metallic chassis ensures that the chips inside are properly cooled and increases the overall sturdiness of the device. Hardware-wise, the drive is available in sizes ranging from 250GB to 2TB and comes with an AS Media M SATA to USB bridge controller rather than one of Samsung's own. The big improvement, however, comes from the newer, more advanced 64-layer 3D VNAND triple-level cell flash memory used, as well as the updated firmware and the support for trim via the USB-attached SCSI protocol. Overall, the Samsung Portable SSD T5 is a masterclass in portable storage. It's proof that an external storage device can be smaller than a high-powered power bank or a stack of credit cards. In fact, the Samsung Portable SSD T5 is so close in size to far more expensive solid-state storage devices like Kingston's Data Traveler Ultimate GT USB drive that you can slip it in your shirt pocket and no one would look at it twice. Factor in the fact that it also comes with a 10 gigabytes per second USB 3.1 Type-C Gen 2 making it capable of delivering twice the maximum theoretical transfer rate of its predecessors, and you've got a device that packs a hefty punch. What's more, the drive is now officially compatible with Android devices and is pitched as shock-resistant, capable of handling drops of up to 2 meters. It's also backwards compatible with USB 3.0 and USB 2.0 if your PC doesn't have a USB Type-C. It's expensive, but it's well worth the cash. Moving on, if you're looking for a portable SSD with lots of features, then you might want to take a look at the Samsung T7 SSD. This external storage is not only fast, with sequential read and write speeds of up to 10,050 and 1,000 megabytes per second respectively, but it also boasts quite a few nifty features in its palm-sized package. The most important of those features is, of course, its built-in security options that use AES 256-bit encryption and give you the option to use fingerprint sign-in, which you can set up through its own management software. The T7 Touch comes formatted as XFAT with a usable capacity of 931 gigabytes. It has three files on it, one of which is the bundled software, the Samsung Portable SSD Plus software needed to enable the fingerprinting capabilities. You can also download the software as an app to use the drive with your Android smartphone, assuming the latter has a Type-C connector. That aside, setting up the fingerprint capabilities is straightforward, as easy as doing it on a smartphone, and so is adding password protection on the T7 Touch. Sure, the Samsung T7 SSD doesn't come cheap, and it could do with a rugged case, but it remains one of the best portable SSDs currently available and well worth considering for purchase. Also, the T7 Touch is king in security, speed, portability, and pricing. Beat that! Yes, it doesn't do IP68 and doesn't have any of the security certifications most of its more expensive rivals have, but at this price point, nobody really cares. For more information and updated prices about the products mentioned, check the links in the description box below. If you enjoyed our video, check out our previous one about the top 5 best SSDs for PS5. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. Thanks!